closed after a car crash near Granite Bay. CBS 13 Tina Cuffer joins us live in Roseville with more on how it's affecting traffic this morning. Good morning, Tina. Good morning to you. Well, that cr uh, crash rather happened just across the street behind us. We wanted to get out of the way so PG&E crews could continue their work safely this morning. But you're looking at Sierra College Boulevard. The power pull down reads East Roseville Parkway because that is the intersection that those drivers would be approaching if they were headed in the northbound direction where one lane is still closed. Now, we did get some video overnight, and police tell us that there was a crash here. You can see the vehicle very badly damaged. It happened just before 11 p.m., and fortunately, the driver was not hurt, so I know the car doesn't look great, but that driver is okay. But there are about 188 customers that are with PG&E without power this morning because when that power pole went down, it really affected those power lines coming here across Sierra College Boulevard. So PG&E tells us at about 10:30 this morning, that's when they're expecting power to be restored to all of those affected customers. And for now, one lane is still closed on Sierra College Boulevard. And so as you're approaching East Roseville Parkway. And the northbound lanes do be aware that there are crews working on the side of the road, so please drive safely. And again, one lane is closed as well as a sidewalk, and so there may be some delays as the traffic starts to pick up later this morning, guys. But for now, uh, fortunately, no one was hurt in this crash overnight. Back to you. All right, Dina, come for a live press this morning in Roseville. Dina, thanks for the update.